I'm going to show some changes we made to the uh, match report. So here we've created a match and added a match report. Uh, we did that for uh, the away team here. As you now see, uh, you can select a starting formation. And if you feel there's a start missing, you're missing a starting formation that you're using, just notify support at sidelinesports.com and we'll add that for you. But when you select a starting formation and you select your players and add their numbers and positions, you will see the starting formation here. Now you can click on the pitch and change how you want this to be represented. So you can go to this full vertical right here. It looks quite nice. You also have some options. You can change the jerseys. If you change that, you need to press close to see it update, but you can either be looking at the back of the jersey or the front. You can change uh, how you, if you show the last name or first name or first and last name and so on. You can select the color of your goalkeeper and the jersey color of your outfield players, and that will be remembered. So that's how you do that. Yeah, then we, we added some uh, things here, such as surface and so on. And otherwise, this is pretty much the same. You have attendance. Participant is here, just the same way as for uh, the practices, so you can take somebody out if you want to. And then lastly, you have uh, this print option here. That's quite nice. This prints out in a, in a nice PDF. You have the options here on the left side, what you want to show. So for example, in this case, we didn't put in anything for the for our opponent. So we just uncheck them right here. So we're focusing on our own team. Uh, so we have this information up here. We have the lineup. And we can uh, check some things we want to have here on the uh, in the table. Then we have the formation and you can also put in the staff. So uh, let's take a look at that. We'll uh, just close this here. So for example, if you scroll down here, now this was the team right here, but if you scroll all the way down, you can add the coach. Uh, and you just press add row to, to select either coach or an external person so that might you might create a new person who is the physio or something be registered on this match report. So try that out. That will all come into the report. Then you could also register the referees that you would then have access to as well.